About 10 years ago, I was once a volunteer for AIDS Concern in Hong Kong. Now, to become a volunteer, you have to be trained by the professionals there. So I remember I enrolled to be a person who received phone calls because there are lots of people who are not very sure about AIDS in Hong Kong. Therefore, this hotline for them is for them to ask questions. And I was trained to do that for three months. So the one little joke that I'd like to share with you was that uh, there was one time, you know, they called me and they were asking questions relating to AIDS and I was talking to them in, in Cantonese and you know, whatnot, whatnot. And all of a sudden this, this caller said, are you Louis Castro? I said, I didn't want to deny. I said, yeah. Oh, I like you very much. And then from that point onwards, they were asking me about what was my latest uh, job, was I recording any new albums, what were my latest TV shows, etc, etc, etc. It was so funny. Now because of that, ever since that day happened, the following days that I was being a volunteer, similar people called and had the same reaction. They found out who I was and they keep, you know, kept, kept asking me questions. So I didn't want to do that anymore. So instead, I changed my position and became a driver for our clients, for people who had AIDS in Hong Kong. So I did that for a while too. But after that, because of my work schedule, I wasn't able to continue. Now why I'd like to share this with you is that when you become a volunteer, of course you have to be trained. Now, being a Hong Kong ambassador, which I am, I'd like to ask you to make an appeal to see if you are interested in helping people with depression, you are most welcome to join us here at Hong Kong. We are waiting for your support. So please do come and help us, okay? Thank you.